today we've got some nice, a very nice song from the Red Book from Montserrat. And we have two different voices, two parts for that. So I was hoping to have a lot of people. So um, because the more people sing this, the better it sounds for this song. This is quite an energetic, um, sort of not raucous, but a very energetic song from the Red Book, the most energetic one. And um, I had an idea, I will repeat that in a minute, if it's not 11 o'clock yet, and so in case you're missing it, uh, I, will, I will say this again. Oh, we have 20 people now, that's lovely. Um, I was thinking uh, to do the same that we did with Hildegard for this song, so that um, I will provide a recording and you sing along to it, and record it and send it to us and we'll make a, make one of those videos again with everyone on the screen or not on the screen. If you don't want to be seen, it can also be uh, just the sound. Um, and uh, in one of the concerts that will come up in September, we will, Claire and I will do a program of general medieval songs. So uh, we've got three different programs coming up for Claire and me. Our first one is a Sephardic one, uh, which will cover most of the songs that we've done in these workshops. And um, that will happen. We will do this as a concert at Holy Trinity in Stroud Green on the 30th of August. Um, there is a very limited um, availability to come and see it live. And I think there are still some tickets available. So if, if you live nearby or if you fancy coming to Stroud Green on the 30th, uh, you can still get tickets for that. And it's only for, th I think the maximum is 30 people. So it might sell out soon. Um, hi and welcome everyone. I can see there's still people coming. Um, thrilled to see so many of you again today. Uh, today is our general medieval repertoire, so we will do a song from the Red Book of Montserrat. Um, and it's me on my own, no Claire today, so I mustn't forget to make some announcements. Um, first of all, I'd like to say that uh, the Hildegard film, Vision, is still available for, five, for a few more days, until Wednesday in fact, when it will be replaced by our next film performance, which will be Joy Smith on the harp, and she will also tell a story, uh, very exciting. Uh, so that will happen, that will premiere this coming Wednesday at eight o'clock. And if I get this right now, it will be available then for a week, Steph, or maybe longer, is that right? Yeah. I think yeah, so. it'll be available for two weeks. Two weeks, okay. So um, if you can't come on Wednesday at eight, but it would be lovely if you did, because um, it's always nice to be there when it gets premiered. But um, Wednesday at eight, this starts and will be available for two weeks. After that, um, we will have the first of the concerts that Claire and I will do. Uh, the Sephardic one will be available um, after two weeks then. And um, as I said a minute ago, we will do a live performance, very exciting, um, on the 30th of August um, at Holy Trinity in Stroud Green. Um, there, there's limited seating, so if you want to come to that, um, there's still some tickets left. And um, the other thing I need to mention is the crowdfunding. It's going very well. Um, we are up to 42% um, of the target. So, if you would like to, um, if you would like to help us with that, I think Steph will put up the link. Uh, yes, um, we'll we'll put up the link for that. Um, if you'd like to help us with that, and we're very grateful for the support. It's amazing how many people are supporting us. So thank you for that. Um, for today's song, which will be. Stella Splendens from the Red Book um, of Montserrat, the Libre Berme. Um, and if you do, haven't downloaded the lyrics yet, go to the telling.co.uk slash lyrics, where you can download um, the score and the lyrics. So 
Um, I think we we are now stable. Here we go. I, let's let's start our session for today. Um, so this song is from this collection from the Red Book, which are all pilgrim songs. So the people that um, made the pilgrimage to Montserrat, the monastery in in Catalonia near Barcelona. Um, sang all these songs. Now, I don't know if you can see this well. I will put up the photo. Um, this is Montserrat. So that means, Serrat in Catalan means ragged. So it's the ragged mountain. And um, these pilgrim songs are for, for the people who, who sang them while they were walking up there. So it's quite a steep uh, climb. And this song is one that is, I think, there to give them energy. It's very rhythmic and energetic. So um, you, some of you might know it. It's one of the more known medieval songs that if you sing in choirs, you probably have done it already. But I'd like to teach us, you both, um, both parts. The higher one that we start with is a tone higher, only a tone really, um, but you have the bass clef in your score, but of course um, we're going to sing it um, in whatever octave you like. If you are female low voice, then then sing the lower one. It won't be um, down in the in the bass clef for you. So let's start with with the first verse, with the first section. For those of you who don't know it, it will be in the end um, sort of in this speed because it, it was there to give people energy while they're walking and if they're getting tired. I don't know if you ever, if you ever sing when you're hiking, it does help when you get tired. If you, if you sing, you suddenly got more energy. So um, this one goes, the first, the first phrase is, Stay las in monte, ut solis radium. So this was quite long. I will do it once very slowly and divide it into two parts, this first phrase. Stay las plendens in monte. Let's do that far again. Stay last plendens in monte. Ut solis radium. Ut solis radium. Again, the whole thing from the beginning. Stay last plendens in monte. Ut solis radium. The second phrase is nearly the same, just with a different ending. So, uh, here it goes. Miraculi serrato, which um, is translated as miraculously glowing. But it's interesting that serrato is like the Catalan word serrat, which must come from Latin, jagged. So, um, here it says glowing. Now, the Latin experts among you, please let me know if serrato means glowing or whether they've mistranslated here. So, um, let's do that second phrase, which is Miraculi serrato e shaudi once more, I will slow it down at the end to get all the little fast notes. Miraculi serrato e shaudi populum. Good. So the ending is e shaudi populum. Once more, e shaudi populum. Right, so um, 
now from the beginning up till here, the whole A section of verse one. And stand a splendid sin monte ut solis radium miraculis serrato e shaudi populum. Great, so that's relatively easy. Now the, the second um, part, the lower voice, Let's go into that. So, the beginning is Stella splendens in monte ut solis radium. That's a bit difficult, that little climb there. I hope you, that's okay. Try to keep it all relaxed while you're going up there. It's not really high. It's just sometimes awkward to, to suddenly have at the end of a phrase when we have no more air to suddenly go up. So we're breathing before ut, uh, ut solis radium. Yeah. So take a really good breath there. So here we go with that, uh, the second part again. Stella splendens in monte ut solis radium. And then, again, like with the uh, first verse, it is nearly the same, um, apart from the ending now, the next phrase, which is Miraculis serrato e shaudi populum. Again, the breath before e shaudi. Once more, this second phrase, miraculis. Miraculis serrato e shaudi populum. So all this time while I'm teaching the second voice, you, all the people that um, want to sing the, the top voice can of course practice already singing this together with the, um, with, with this second voice. So I will now sing the, uh, uh, the higher part from beginning till here, as far as we got, and then I will sing the second one. So if you do the other one, try to sing already with me. We do it now a tempo and in the rhythm. I will give you one, two, three, four. Stella splendens in monte ut solis radium miraculis serrato e shaudi populum. And here is the second uh, part, the lower one. One, two, three. So, no, sorry, I did the wrong um, words. Once more, three, four. Stella splendens in monte ut sodis radium miraculis serrato e shaudi Good. I hope that was okay. We will get more opportunity to uh, to do it like that again. Now let's look at the B section. So here is where our um, higher voices uh, get to sing their high note. It's the only time a D comes. So here we are. Slowly now, um, the B section for the sopranos or tenors. Concurrent Gaudentis populi. Once more. Concurrent universi. Gaudentis populi. Now breathe wherever while we're doing it slowly. But of course, once we do it at tempo, before gaudentes, it, we take a good breath. <laughs> 
yeah so unless you are uh, have amazing breath control and want to do the whole phrase in one but um uh, so a little bit faster now and then we do the second text as well which is exactly the same uh, uh, in terms of the notes so one and two Concurrum diversi Gaudentes populi Divites et igeni Grandes et parvuli Right, now the um, altos and baritones and basses um, if you're following the score, um, you see a tie on the first note with the next one. Now, the text here doesn't allow us to uh, have a tie. So the tie only, only comes really into play if there is less words and we've, we've got enough syllables to just do a long note. So actually ignore the, 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 the ties, it goes. Divitis et egeni. I did again the mistake. Sorry, um, I started with the um, the with the second text. Now, just because I'm going to the lower voice, I'm doing the lower text. Sorry about that. Once more, concurrent, concurrent, universi gaudentes populi. Once more, same text. Concurrent universi gaude. Oh, I, I made a uh, mess. Concurrent universi gaudentes populi. Once more. Concurrent universi. Gaudentes populi. Second text. Divitis et egeni grandes et parvuli. Once more, second text. Divitis et egeni grandes et parvuli. So if you're following the score, um, you will have noticed by now that the syllable distribution is different to what is written there. What is written there is really for the higher um, voice. The lower one doesn't have um, a syllable that extends over several notes. So that's why we need to grab especially the syllable of gaudentes and of grandes, it comes earlier than is written there but you you will have grasped it by now i will go through it once more for the lower voices um both texts now from concurrent and concurrent universi gaudentes populi divites et geni grandes et parvuli so I hope that's clear. Um, after that, we go back to the melody of the A section, but um, with a different text. Ipsum ingrediuntur ut cernunt oculi et in de revertuntur gratiis repleti. So um, uh, after that, we go back to Stella. So if some people are just following the text, basically the structure is A, A, B, B, A, A. Um, and the first and last A is always Stella Splendens. No matter what, what we, um, if when we go to the second verse, even there, it will be like that. Okay, so... Um, Let's let's try and run this. It may be confusing, but um, I will now sing through the higher voice, the total of it, starting with Stella Splendens, um, going straight into the B section. Then, actually, I I, I said it wrongly. Um, 
I, I just realized it is A B B A A. It's not twice A. Sorry. So it's A B B and then A and A with Stella's blendings again. So I will I will run that through once with the higher voices, then with the lower, and please sing to it with the uh, other voice if you can. So one, two, three, four. Stella's blendings in Monte Utsolis Radium Miraculis Serrato E Shaudi Populum Concurrunt Universi Gaudentes Populi Right, and then we would go on to the text of um, two. If if we had continued now, it would be now Principes et Maniats, which you've got. I hope if you've downloaded it, but um, we don't need it yet, um, Steph. So uh, because now we're going to do the the low voices. I hope I won't make a mistake because now I'm looking at the wrong text while I'm doing that. Okay, so. Um, Four into it. One. Is the Stella's blendens in Monte Ut solis radium Miraculis errato E shaudi populum Concurrum Universi gaudentes populi, divides et geni, grandes et parvuli, ipsum ingredi untu, ut serdum docuni, et in de revertu. Great. I hope you had fun um, singing the other voice to it. So now let's look at the um, second verse. So if you um, are interested in recording yourself with this, uh, it would be great. The more people we have, the better. I think it would be amazing if nearly all of you could participate. And you see, this is a song that doesn't need beautiful or trained voices this can be kind of belted out so um uh i hope this will encourage those of you who think they don't have beautiful voices you know i mean there's i've, I've seen amazing um lack of confidence and of knowing how beautiful one's voices uh, are in my life so um anyway now principis et maniats Let's go with the sopranos first, slowly ones, so that we know where the syllables go. Principis et maniats estirbe regia. Okay. Seculi potestates Obtenta venia. Once more, the whole thing, both texts. Principes et maniats extirpe regia. 
Seculi patistates obtenda venia. Now the low voices for this one. Principis et maniat extirpe regia. So you see we have here uh, maniahats. So there we have uh, one syllable with two notes. Once more that bit. Principis et maniahats extirpe regia seculi potestatis obtenta venia here all a uh, note per syllable okay let's do that second text seculi seculi potestatis Obtenta venia. Right? So I will do again now the higher voices for this B section, the beginning of verse two. Our tempo this time. One, two, three, four. Principe set maniat, extirpe regia. The low voices. Three, four. Principis et maniat extirpe regia. Seculi potestatis obtenda venia. Good. High voices now for return to A with the text now of Pecaminum Proclamant. They proclaim their sins and beat their breasts. Tundentes pectora. So uh, this is now the uh, return to A section. High voices. Um, Pecaminum proclamant tundentes pectorum. Oh, I'm, I'm getting battered up. Pectorum. Pectora, not pectorum. Once more. Sorry about that. Pecaminum proclamant Tundentis pectora, hoplite flesho clamant, hic ave maria. Once more, that last section from hoplite. Hoplite flesho Now, the low voices for this return to A, Pecaminum Proclamant. Pecami, Pecaminum Proclamant, Tundentes Pectora, Poplite Flesho Clamant, Ic Ave Maria. Once more, whole A, um, return to A section with the low voices. Pecaminum proclamant tundentes pectora poplite flesho Namant Ave Maria. And then we would.
would go back to Stella Splendens. So, um, then we, we, so then we repeat A section with Stella Splendens and then we'd go into three. Now that might make it slightly too long, although once you sing it all uh, through, it passes quite quickly. Um, but for today, I think one and two is enough. Um, uh, I think we should run, um, let's do the whole verse one, yeah? Which means A, B, B, A, A. Uh, I will do, um, I will start A with the high voices. So the low ones of you sing along with me and the high sing along with me. Then for the uh, B section, I will first do the low and then the high. Then going back to A, I will first sing the low and finish it with the high. Okay, so um, uh, here we go. I will start off with the high voices. And one, two. Stand a splendens in monte, ut solis radium, miraculis serrano, e shaudi populum, concurrunt universi gaudentes populi, Right, so thank you so much for joining me with this one. Um, stay tuned for um, a revised recording for you to uh, then sing to. If you're interested, um, please let us know if you want to uh, send a recording of two verses of this. So uh, I will put with the recording also a reminder of the structure of it. So thank you so much. And I think um, uh, for people who want to go already and not have the chaos, see you next week when it's back to Sephardic songs. And um, if you'd like to now sing a bit of Stella Splendens, whatever voice, let's hear you um, do some of it. And I hope I didn't forget anything, Steph, to mention. No, I think that's, that's all fine. See you next week again. Claire will be back. And let's unmute everyone and go. Stella Splendens in Upsolis radium, miraculis serrato, e shaudi Wonderful, Julia. I don't know if you're the only one who's singing here. Oh, sorry. Thank you. See you Thanks. next week. Bye-bye. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Julia. <laughs>